what's going on YouTube? Angry Chin. I got some skull bandits in my mouth. I'm not a huge dipper, but I had a party, so I had a tin. And uh, I'm just uh, doing a little bit of dip because I'm getting kind of low on the cigars and I'm kind of aging them out and I want to wait for the warmer weather before I crack into that. And my uh, pipe tobacco is pretty much all dried out. So basically, I just want to ask a question to the Americans right now. To all the Americans out there that buy cigars and all that. What is your take on the whole cigar ban, I guess you could say, between Cuba and America? Do you think that you should be able to buy them? If they lifted it, would you buy them? And how do you think it would affect the cigar industry right now? Because there's a ton of people in the States. And there's a ton of cigar smokers. And there's a ton of different cigar companies. Do you think by opening it up would it affect that by any chance? And like I said, as, a, as an American, would it uh, make you go out and buy them? And how do you think it would affect the cigar industry? You know, like a fellow Canadian, we can buy them. And I personally don't, doesn't think, don't really think it has too much effect on uh, the cigar industry that we can buy them. It's just, it just makes me wonder, like, if tomorrow they said, yeah, but we're going to let the band up and Americans buy Cubans. Like, would it make you go out and buy Cubans? Would you start buying them? How would you feel about that? And, uh, you know, just what's your take on it? Be honest with you. Because in Canada, we can pre we pretty much get everything in Canada. Anything tobacco related. There's not too many things that are banned. Except for maybe uh, flavored cigarettes, I think, are, are banned. But, uh, you know, what's your take on it? So, uh, be honest with you, I can't really say much because I'm not an American. So I wouldn't really, I don't really know seeing how we can go buy them but uh what's your take on it let me know in the comments there what do you think and uh how how do you think it affect the cigar industry would it better it or would it make it worse or you know would it uh even the playing field i guess you could say because there's lots and lots and lots and lots of different cigar brands in the states and uh i'm just wondering just curious let me know what you think and uh put in the comments and uh let me know what your views are. By all means, if you want to do VR, do VR. But uh, just kind of, just kind of thinking about that a couple minutes ago. If it was free range for Cuban cigars all across the map, how do you think it affected? And uh, like I said, would it uh, compulse you, or you know, would you go out and buy them? And then uh, that's about it, really. I don't know where to go from there. Like I said, I, don't, I, don't, I personally don't have too much of an opinion on it because, like I said, I'm a, you know, in Canada we can buy them. But I'm interested to see what. Uh, fellow Americans think about the whole situation and the ordeal so uh, yeah that's about it pretty uh, quick little video other than that can't really say much our snow's melting and it's getting warmer out so uh, good things are coming around and I'm the beer pong champion so yeah that's about it let me know what you think looking forward to hearing it